It's just awesome. You know, anytime you beat these guys, you've, you've done something. I had a phenomenal week, ended up in a side of prices. I think that's pretty good. Raleigh has an unbelievable uh, group of lakes and, and some great fisheries and some really big fish. Boom. Whoa! Oh, yeah! Here's what I'm talking about. I set the hook and it did not move. And I was sitting there like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! Gosh dang gorilla! All the stars and everything lined up, you know. I thank the good Lord for, for allowing us to go to a lake like that. <laughs> I, I had a little prior knowledge to it and uh and, and I, I knew those fish that they were spawning, they would be around that, you know, type of that that the cover that I was fishing. Took over the lead at the end of the second. Look at that fish. Ten. Nine, but I knew, I knew also just as fast as I came to the top, someone else could too, and Frosty was catching them good. The best way I thought I could catch them was with a wacky worm. I threw a V&M chopstick and, and basically that's all I had in my hand all day long. This is the way I want to explain. This is like unknown places for all of us. See how beautiful they have this fish? So you don't know what to expect to get here. This is a pure, just a, you know, you use your instincts and this format to get no information. Not even talk to roommate. This is like, uh, do your own things, 100%. Uh, yeah, yeah. One time you're at the top, the next time you're down at the bottom and then, then you move back up. Oh my gosh. Score tracker update, score tracker update. At the end, I didn't like that score tracker update, but it worked out. Woo, baby! Start getting ready for Chickamauga. We'll be there in a week. So, you know, I, I like that place too. So we'll see what happens. On to Chickamauga, home, home lake, and have an opportunity to try to make that championship round there and maybe, maybe have a chance to win. So just move on to the next one. I see you at the Chickamauga.